One of the things that would help me is if more people knew about what the heck I did. I was only 12 years old, and I said, this is the world I want to be in. It's a tough life. It's a really tough life. It's not for the timid. It's not a phase you're going through. It's actually one's life work. I look at a stage like a painting, a frame painting, you know, the proscenium, and except it has depth like a sculpture. The only reason I choreograph is because of music. I'm interested in a very big picture of dancing. I work only with live musicians and with the score. My whole uh, modus operandi is a musical one. I always say, you know, a dancer's career is too short, but I want to be the star. I want to be a featured artist, and I don't believe in the traditional working up the ranks. Because I had a problem with that. I got labeled as being a bad boy. What I like very much about um, a non-Indian audience in Europe and in America is that it's very uh, far away from things that they usually see. I feel that they participate in, the, in this energy and this emotion that is given out through the dance. We arrived here on Monday and it's really an interesting thing to try and put together an eight minute ballet in, in four days and get it clean and performance ready. I mean, that's amazing, but the, the feeling that that creates, the energy that that creates, is so much fun and it, it really brings everyone together. Here you have you know, people from five, six different countries dancing together. One of the great joys for me was bringing vaudeville sensibility up here. You come into the room with a bunch of ballerinas and you say, we're gonna work on something that you should all know. It's the Charleston. You'll be able to grow here, you have time to to hone your skills, you have, if you're choreographing, you have time to stretch yourself and grow emotionally and physically and spiritually. For my dancers to be involved, to be exposed to other companies, other dancers, other workshops, for us to be giving workshops is quite a unique environment. When you work with a small group, direct and close contact, it's as if it's choreographed. It becomes very intimate. We all are searching for a kind of freedom where we can weightlessly fly above it all. <laughs>